first pick right now. You a fan? We're gonna see you guys draft like in a second, so it doesn't matter. You don't have to hide. Am this. I supposed to protect Bulma from saying <laughs> shit at the summit again? <laughs> yeah. Okay, Bulma, thank you. Uh, you hold me in my ear, and we're good to go now. Thanks, Bulma. Good luck <laughs> Thanks later. Thanks for the insight, Sam. What are you doing? Cast. We're casting <laughs> the game. Clearly. Did you finish your podcast last night, Cap? No, we never got you to. You want to be on it, Sam? I don't know about that. Sorry. Our tour was on it. You can be on it. Like Our tour had a great time. Yeah. I won't have a great time. Why? Sam, you're, hell? you're a weird guy. People don't you like hanging out with me, Sam? I do. Okay. Sam, I That's swear. I'll make sure you're never on another team if you don't do that podcast. <laughs> <laughs> Be careful. People people might think you're serious. <laughs> oh. uh, but for real, I mean, what dude, what happened to just trash oh. talking? Like, cause I I know Bulba, and that, it's clear like Bulba and Husky are friends, and the fact people took that so I don't know, man. You know, people just take shit seriously. The thing is, I love, I love trash talk. Same. As long as it's not harmful. I think Sam probably that Sam, was not harmful. Right here, you what? you went a little bit too far. I don't think was so. it too far. I think you were kind of being a dick. I mean, I it's a joke. Like, do you think I'm gonna go out of my I way think, to no, message no, no, people? No, no, of course not. Of course not. We we talked about this. I definitely don't think that you would actually do anything a hundred percent. But I think in the moment you were heated. I mean, it's just like trash talk. It's like, you know, when you're playing like Halo with the boys, you know, you're trash <laughs> talking. Like, like, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, uh, keep, are, keep, keep camping. Yeah. You know what? Lockout. You play the map Lockout on yes. Halo. Yeah, yeah, There's yeah, always yeah. that one like tunnel where like this idiot would always camp. Mm -hmm. And then mm -hmm. your, your friend does it and you'll be like, I'm going to beat your ass up after. But after we're going to go eat pizza, you know? Or... <laughs> and then his friend looks over and sees Sam. He's yeah. like, what? Yeah. It's just, it's just you know, but Sam, gone, you... gone are those days, you know? Gone, gone are those days. Sam, did you now you got to be politically correct. What? Wait, what? <laughs> Sam, did you watch the drafts? Uh, game one, yeah, I saw the draft. Did you think we won the draft? Wait, are you... On you're, liquid, you're, yeah. Why are you not in the room with them when they're drafting? <laughs> <laughs> Dude, somebody literally Dude, asked me all the of these question. coaches are schooling Blitz on what to How do to coach. coach. I mean, they're chilling right Don, now. why aren't you with them? We're chilling right now. Yeah, Let's chilling. go. Big chilling. Um, I, 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 I saw the drop. I didn't watch the first, like, 15 minutes because I was on the shuttle here. Sure, sure. So, and then my uh, service was too slow in the car. But, but did, you, did you think the Husqvarna lineup was better? Um... I mean, I thought uh, Boxy got one of his best heroes, so I thought maybe okay. he could go ham, but yeah. he didn't go ham, right? Mm. He went mini ham. Mini ham? Yeah, uh, he, ham went, like, he went like, he went bacon. But he's a vegetarian, <laughs> so I don't know if he should go ham then. Maybe he needs to go, you know, He's vegan. Else. He'd like that distinction <laughs> to be known. Is he actually yeah. vegan? He's vegan, yes. What, what, like, is he a tier four vegan? I don't or know what, is what, he? what tiers we have, but. Well, a tier five vegan is when you grow your own mulch in your pocket and eat it. <laughs> <laughs> is he a tier four or a tier two? Wait, I can Bulma's actually. Bulma's actually cool. I think I made that up. Don't actually. I'm, Google I'm like searching up tier four vegan. I mean, there are different tiers of vegan. I mean, there is. There's like, it's like you know, being a tier of like how fat you are or something. You know, yeah. like it's a tier of being vegan or a tier yeah. of anything. There is. There's always yeah. tiers of Dota teams. Like the lowest one is like the vegetarians that also say they eat fish. Yeah. Like, that's like I'm vegetarian. vegetarian. Yeah, but then you got those people to be like, that's. I know it's pescatarian, but like. You go to a restaurant and then, you know, and these guys are like, yeah, I'm, I'm vegetarian. And then I'll order the fish, you know, thing. And I'm like, you're not vegetarian. Sam, Why can't you just say you're pescatarian? <laughs> no, I'm just saying, like, you should just say you're pescatarian. Like, but now people have no started saying that No one knows what that, that means, shit. though. I so, thought that so sounded like a religion. I'm a <laughs> pescatarian. I don't know. I'm yeah. okay. No, I, I, I recently went to, like, some Asian country and then I'm, like, I'm vegetarian. And then they put, like, fish sauce in my thing. And I'm like, this isn't vegetarian. Fish and sauce then, doesn't have fish in it, I thought. Wait, really? I thought it was just for flavor, dude. Wait, so what does it have in it? it? Let me Google this. Cow? Wait, does fish sauce really not have fish in it? Because I thought it does. Let me just... I don't, I don't know. Let me yeah, just and then the other tier this. of vegetarian is like... Then it's like, you know, actual vegetarian. And then mm -hmm. it's vegan t vegan tier one. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? Yeah. Like, through Q7, no. yeah. <laughs> I don't know what one. the tiers are, but... Okay. Yeah. I, I, I get it. They listen to indie music. Mm. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> they, listen that, to, they listen to Nickelback. And yeah. <laughs> no, no, that's tier. That's tier five. Nickelback's <laughs> tier five. Dude, come on. Oh, tier it, it does. It's anchovies and sea salt. Yeah. Mm. You're correct, Sam. Tier two is like EDM concerts. Uh, you know, okay. talk about everyone that you're vegan. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Drink Oatly. <laughs> what? What the hell's Oatly? <laughs> How do you know what Oatly that, that's, is? That's uh, oat milk, right? Yeah. Yeah, it's good. Vegetarian. It's actually really good. Yeah. Like oat milk. Oat milk is probably the best thing to happen to humans this year. Sam, I live in California. I live in Los what Angeles. So I'm aware of these. What? <laughs> Sam, on a real note, I'm gonna try to bring this back. Whose draft 
you liking right now? Well, wait for one more pick, so yeah. it's four before. Yeah, yeah. Wait for one more pick. <laughs> okay. Um, it's got to be even. Well, Liquids is very blue. Mm. You're really copying us, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Liquids is blue. <laughs> to be fair, we got him with this <laughs> last time. <laughs> Sam asked you got him with the blue lineup. No, so whenever Sam asks us about drafts, um, we always just tell him. We yeah, always it's, just tell it's him. It's like, funny. Yeah, it's we funny. always just say we pick stuff. Oh look, it's blue. Oh, okay. Oh so gosh. now, who are you favoring? You're going into this matchup. Who, uh, Who's oh, ahead? Who's ahead? Mickey has a pretty good morphing, right? So yeah. his mor- it's a pr- you know could be a good morph game. Yeah. So his morph might win this game. Can't say much else. That's fine. Why can't you say much else? I mean, I'm saying the, it's a good morph game. You know the best part about being on a panel? I can just say this straight up in front of Sam because he'll forget. But uh, <laughs> if you talk to him long enough, he will reveal Dota stuff to you. Yeah, that's why he, he's probably going to have to leave here in a minute, Sam. <laughs> well, that's, gotcha. a, that's why we can go back to the vegan conversation. <laughs> yep, exactly. Now, th- Sam, thank you for taking time out of your very busy day to you know, give us some insight. Hey. I was I was asked to be on here. Yeah, <laughs> I, I you. said thank no, you. We're, I was we're literally serious. saying it was thank good you. And, and now Sam. I'm leaving. Yeah, Dude, goodbye. I was trying to get Sam. info out of Sam. Yeah. Grant, you really just you stepped well, yeah. in the. I had to. I, I trust you me. Protect Sam, his boys. Sam at the summit is an exposer. <laughs> you gotta you gotta keep him down. Dude, last time I had him on, <laughs> well, that's a call. I was an exposer. I wasn't even I wasn't even on the couch, or I wasn't even on a team at the time. And Sam came on the couch, and after game two, EG was like, yeah, we're putting a stop yeah, to that. Yeah, I point. remember that. Yeah. But he I mean, can't help himself. It's good. but you just let the boy be the boy. Yeah. I mean, does EG really understand, though? Most of Reddit already knows these yeah, things. Yeah, yeah. True. Yeah. I mean, if you're smart and you think about the game for more than five seconds, you'd understand it. Yeah. Yeah. Obviously. Yeah. Someone as high IQ as us. So we have Bulba. Who do you guys think's in the lead here? V- pretty similar drafts from last game. You're switching up a couple heroes here, but there's oh, an ancient prophet. Oh boy! Is that a okay? Is that five. is that a Aiden hero? It <laughs> is now. Let me Same say, I saw the... him pick it once, um, and then he was like six and one, and then I decided to uh, distract him because he distracted me in my pub, and he didn't speak to me for the entire day. <laughs> So, does that mean he's a good nature's prophet? <laughs> Honestly, that was the only time I've seen him play it, so I can't tell. Yeah. I, I really, as a coach now, I kind of wish that I hadn't gotten my revenge. <laughs> so I could actually tell. Well, we're we're going to see... Uh, Overall last he, he likes uh, uh He likes FNG, right? Oh, he it's, loves FNG. Right, so uh, maybe he watched FNG's nature's prophet and was like, damn, I want to be that. I want to be that guy. All fives... Love other fives because they think they're a part of some like mystic struggle against <laughs> yeah. the world that like nobody else gets. <laughs> nobody else understands Dota like us fives. Am I right? Yeah, it's a real circle jerk where everyone's just like, "Oh man, nobody really understands how much effort we put in." And then I, we always make <laughs> yeah, fun of them. Yeah, you know what the off laner corner looks like? We're just taking those lashes and just <laughs> beating our backs. Everyone in Dota thinks they have like the hardest like life in the world. You know, it's like. <laughs> All these like mid players with like their anime profile pictures that think they're like Naruto or something. <laughs> I'm just trying to have a skilled one on one matchup and these supports roaming into the lane. No, yeah. I think I think it's uh So the the one knock on Nature's Prophet is you put a lot of pressure on the map. Um but when it comes to like a straight up five on five, the hero isn't amazing. Cause you don't really you you have like a pseudo stun or like what do you say Grant Swedo which <laughs> in in the royal form that is correct <laughs> just royal. so we know yo big jams is that correct <laughs> <laughs> is Swedo right no he's shaking his head no all Grant. right we've got a troll warlord and that means you got a pretty hard carry it's an overall last pick you have the Mickey on the morphling you've got that dark willow you've got that slardar again the question is who can take it the only person who can answer that question is Cap and Blitz but I'm gonna let you stew in it. In the slow cooker, we're going to take a quick less than a minute and one second break, and we'll be right back. Into the game we go. Fnatic versus Liquid. We need some revenge from Liquid, or will they get 2 0 in the first series of loop at Dota Summit 12? Now, guys, I let you stew. Yeah. Who's drafted you like? I mean, I said Liquid last time. <laughs> I like Liquids again, okay. so good job, Fnatic. Yeah, I think uh, Liquid has a good lineup. I will say, I think Troll, when it comes to like the ultra late, matches up quite nice against Morph. 
Like once you get like Bastion, yeah, then you you actually just rip them apart. But before that point in time, it's it's yeah. kind of hard, right? Yeah, because you uh, you can burst his teammates, and he can't do too much about it. Yeah, and, and even you can get bursted yeah. like, pretty early on. The uh, the one thing is, it is a really good lane matchup against Slardar. And uh, twenty three Savage. You already know. He he. <laughs> He told Sunby or wh whoever was deciding that draft, like, you're not doing that to me again. <laughs> Work. <laughs> you're going to give me a better lane than last time. No homie stock here. No homie stock. Looks like Quakefa will just go back. Get to get the block. Will it be a two for two ruin exchange? Sure will. No shenanigans this time. And all right, so we swap it up. It will be Void Spirit for Liquid on Quakefa, and it will be Moon on that Ember. Obviously, Ember was in the safe lane last game, but how does this matchup go? I feel like we don't see it as much because we do see Embers in the safe lane more now. Mm. Feels like Void Spirit just wins any lane, so I don't know. I don't think he wins every lane, but I think the main thing about Void Spirit, like what makes him really good, is he always has a way to secure the range creep yeah. with either his Aether Remnant or his. Uh, what is it? It's not dissimilar, it's uh, Resonant Pulse. Yeah. Yep. The, um, I think the matchup is. Um, it's play dependent, Ooh. and it's dependent on the Void Spirit being able to land his Aether Remnant. Yeah. Right? In order to break, break uh, Flame Guard in the level 3 and 4 area, you need to be able to land both your Resonant Pulse and your Aether Remnant. And oh my. Right now it is 4 to 2, and he did miss that range creep with the Resonating Pulse. So That's pretty Ember, big. Ember is he's having a good time. Uh, outside of that, though, outside of just the lane itself, I know the lockdown makes it really hard to play Void Spirit. Like, the just the instant disable. They do have a lot of disable for this Void Spirit. They're going to run at each other here under the tower. He'll get that range creep deny. That hurts. Oh, you, you see it coming. You see Oh, I love range creep denies. I would rather die than give up a range creep. I think I agree. Especially in the mid lane. You know, you're on a, you're on a side lane. Okay, there's two heroes. But 1v1, you miss one. You know it's on you. Yeah, and then you if die. you die, you miss a full creep yeah. wave. Yep, and then you definitely know it's on you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if I'm taking that exchange, guys. <laughs> bottom lane. And this clock we're here, we talked a little bit about. They're playing it in uh, the off lane on Ice Ice Ice, obviously. Do you still go that kind of uh, the Ags build? Is it that good still? No. No? What I, have you been seeing? I think Ags is like you a die. fourth or fifth no, item okay. at best. No. And it's pretty rare to see Clockworks have a successful enough game to get that far in their item. Uh, I think you go the tank build. Okay. So you're going to pick up uh, a couple of bracers. You're going to go uh, Crimson Guard or Pipe. Uh, I think four staff is still important. Well, that helps his case there. He gets the first blood on Insania. That's pretty surprising. I didn't think that could happen. No. Because you have so many trains. Plus, you can uh, sprout yourself out of cogs. Yeah. Very annoying hunting uh, Furion because he can. Uh, so he just sprouts inside of the cogs and he will pop. He will pop out. Do you guys well, say well, trains or trends? Trends. Trends. Because they're part of trees, so inherently, trees should be in the name. Right? Wait, I just realized. Don't go. Don't think too far about this. Point. I think I am, and I'm in <laughs> deep now. Looking back what at Lord the of the lore? Rings, so it is tree ant. Why isn't it tree ant? Because an ant is a tree, right? Like an ent. Yeah, so why is it tree ant and not tree int? Tree ant. Am are, I crazy? are you asking why Ice Frog didn't name them T R E E, -E N T? Yes. I am. Do you have an answer? I, I <laughs> okay, don't. I oh, apologize. I'll hit up Ice Frog. I'll just call him up between this game and <laughs> my the next boy. And get an answer for call you. my boy. Yeah. So the ages <laughs> thing, like I'm cool with that, but the tree <laughs> <and> thing, <laughs> suspect. <laughs> Jabs into the jungle, trying to pull the creeps away. Boxy level three. And it's just tough because you do already have the boots on jabs. Boxy does not, so hard to get on top of him. It's like when people, uh, a lot of European players I know say threads. Is that on treads? Treads. That was a big thing in Dota 1, too. People actually didn't know. Yeah. It does sound cooler, too. Like, yo, what threads you wearing? True. Abaddon. That was a big one in Warcraft 3. Yep. Everyone called him Abaddon. I, mean, I still do. I so. still do. <laughs> I still, it has, yeah. I say Because I say Abba a lot. Yeah, same. Oh, Moon, 23-7 versus 16-5 and five middle. That Ember Spear going to get level 5. Four, Wait, four how minutes. can you just go against the lore like that? What lore? Baden calls himself a bad. That's but, the lore, dog. But the thing is, who knows someone better than their own father? Are you the dad? <laughs> yes, I actually, in lore, I am the father of Abba. 
<laughs> so Dude, I'm so confused. <laughs> Same, you know he's not confused. Mickey, because he's about to get a kill on DJ, it looks like. Yes, start right claiming is fade bolted, so a lot of reduced damage, but still gets the kill. And they needed that return kill. Rubik lanes are so nice to play against Morph. Just take a lot of that damage. It's hard. It's normally very hard to die, and it's really good harass because you outrange him. That's the one. 23 Savage did have that overall last pick as Troll, and he is farming up very well, so... It looks similar to last game, except it switched around where the three top uh, last hit denies are on Fnatic here. Taiga, get to try to run. The Creepway pull, ooh, loses vision. Nighttime hits right then, and yeah, he'll make it out. I think they uh, that, w that was kind of smart, and something that Jabs won't repeat again. That Taiga with Shadow Realm, he'll always, because the creeps won't aggro onto you yes. when you're Shadow Realms, right? So they'll always just walk away. Ooh, ice, ice, ice. He's hot and he wants, and Xenia won't be able to find him. A gank? He's gonna come on to Moon, but he'll just back up. Try to get some last hits here. So this game, I mean, who is... You said Troll does become good against Morph when he gets a lot of items. So that means Liquid needs to look to push towers and end the game earlier than Fnatic? Yeah. You wanna... It, it's again... Like, no! <laughs> Did oh. he get it? What? He didn't. He the put bottle? it into his backpack. Oh, and I think that stopped the bottle it. charge yeah, from did. going in. Because he did the mangoes. Oh, uh, no. That hurts. Aiden, what is you doing, child? Yeah. Did have the salve, so at least he's still full HP in middle, but that hurts. A full 1k lead for Fnatic now. I think there's a, another timing where Trolls is... Uh, you're susceptible to dying and stuff, but if you can get on top of him, if you go the defusal build, right, then you can be kind of effective against Morphling. Ooh, AK okay, getting run down. Does have the morph, though. No threat of dying, just get that region, as you talked about in that first 10 minutes. Don't matter if you die, just get rid of that region. Do you think he'll go Diffusal or Basher build? Diffusal. Diffusal. I would go Diffusal. Yeah, I think it's really good versus Void Spirit, too. Sardar has uh, mana issues. Uh-oh, and yeah, Insania, he actually picked up that Invis rune bottom. They didn't know he was here, but they can't really turn around quite yet. Maybe they can on Ice Ice Ice. It'd be a nice kill to get. Does get stunned These up, but look nice at how strokes. slow they are. Yeah, they really are. But it looks like they will have enough to kill Ice Ice Ice. They're trying, but he had to morph so much strength. The creeps. Ooh. That range creep gets the last hit there. And they finally punished. That was a deep dive under the tower, so it's good they got something out of it. That's Boxy. something Mickey's gonna have to be careful with. His, uh, oh, has a bash hit next, but it does wand. He's Sorry. got his ulti. He's fine. Yeah. He's gotta yeah. be careful about Your engaging there. Like this troll's having own. such a free time. He's not pressured at all. Yeah. It would have to be uh, mid that has to make the rotation up there, but I think Quicko is like focusing on trying to like come back into this mid lane himself. But I think what you do is you swap the Dark Willow mid, and then you immediately just go top. Yeah. C23 Savage. Just gonna farm the jungle up, wait for the creeps to push in. Yeah. Quite I think safe. 23 Savage was anticipating that move actually. That's why he went into the jungle right there because mm. Quakefo went missing. And he went back and if he doesn't TP mid, then I think he just farms deeper into the right side of the jungle. Like I think he should feel comfortable about showing back up in lane now that it's been confirmed that he TP. Aetherlands will pull in, but the rune will be bottom. And man, both teams very focused on the runes this game. Two supports bottom, both middles up top. Well, Slarder does have treads, so I'll put some good damage. Make a Soon gonna have your level six on ice, and then we'll see more opportunities to be able to roam around. It's gonna be a significant difference. Like both uh, mids are like the big rotating power. They're gonna make kills happen. Um, but the difference between these two is that Liquid has an offlaner that wants to be able to stay in lane and take his tower, wh whereas Clock wants to do the opposite. He wants to leave lane, kill some other lane, pressure that tower instead. You talked about the mids, the rotators. We do see the Ember already up top. Try not to give away that he's up here, actually. But now he will. Hello. Mickey up here as well. Hi. Do you think Dota heroes, like, talk to each other outside the game <laughs> like toys like because you know this is a battle arena like they are in here yeah exactly like toy story or like what's that movie with the misfit island rudolph the red-nosed reindeer remember the toy misfit island i don't know 
whatever. I've never heard of this, but continue. What? It's in that. Rudolph the freaking Red. Oh my I, lord! I believe you, but I you guys haven't not. seen it. No, I think I'm I think sure your lore of point, Rudolph might be a bit stronger than me. Okay, excellent. So what do you do if you're Liquid here? Because it feels like the the oh. gold lead slowly going up. Uh oh, gonna try to dive under the tower here. Can they get him? Ooh, nice. Eight, the remnant pulls him on in. Can they bring him down? DJ's here. Ice 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 is here as well. Still not level six, though. Nice rotation by Fnatic. They were really quick about that. In most cases, that's a dead uh, that's a dead troll that used TP to get down there, and then the morph gets a bit ahead. But I think they recognize, like, we can't just completely ditch him. Like, he'll die here. So they're there. It's... A lot, I believe it was about 7-7 seven to seven last game at the 10 minute mark, 2-2, two to two, a little bit slower. Troll, I mean, he's the big one on this. You look at that net worth and just that bar. It's a pretty big lead over the next closest, who's his team as well. I just feel really good if I'm in this position where I have taken the enemy safe lane tower and my safe lane tower is still up. I have options, right? I can go back and defend if I want to, if I feel like we can take a team fight confidently. If not, I could just play you know, continue and just trade out, right? I'm gonna sit there at bottom lane and just threaten their tier two if they go for a full push at top lane. Yeah. And you know the game feels good when you can camp your support at lanes and just push stuff out. Yeah. Ooh, they're gonna jump forward. They wanna get this kill. They wanna get this tier one tower like you talked about. And Jazz, man, he gets knocked in, but Mickey ends up dying to Moon. And there's a tip. This just now means that Fnatic feel even more confident to be able to like sit aggressively in mid lane. Simultaneously, Troll feels comfortable being able to hit that bottom tier two. It's like a dream trade-off of your safe lane tower. They do bring down that middle. Root will be there from Taiga. Can Ice 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 just walk out of this stun? Will be coming in about one second. We'll get TP'd on. Do you sprout in front of him or do you sprout him? He sprouted him. He blocks him in with the trades. It should be enough to get the kill. Well played. Took the mid tower though for it. Yeah. Somebody needed to be there sooner. Like getting the kill on the Grimstroke top is not nearly as impactful. I think the assumption is like Mickey just sits mid and pushes the wave back out. Yeah. But as soon as he dies, like somebody has to make that move. The worst part is they gave up on that safe lane tower push, so that tower's still alive. Yeah. Oh, and man. they lost mid. It's still very healthy too. And you would expect them to have a little bit better lane control just because of the Furion presence around the map, but not the case here. Fnatic are just. Uh, just aggressively pushing in all these lanes at once. 10 agility over the 250 health for Troll. I'm not too scared of anything. And they it feels just, like he yeah. just sat top for like seven minutes. Now he's just sat bottom for five minutes, and they just don't really have an answer. We saw him try to go once, but as Blitz said, the, the supports are right there behind him. I was going to say, Moon, it's like he's right in front of the tier yeah, two, the same as 23 yeah. Savage, right? They're pushing these yeah. lanes all the way up onto your side of the map. Well, Moon just bypassed the tier two. Yeah. Liquid doesn't feel comfortable at making any moves, whereas Fnatic, uh, they feel like they can get real deep into the map. And this just speaks to like how badly the laning phase went for yeah. Liquid, where they feel like they have to make these moves as like three or four people. Oh, and he ate, he dodges the Aether Remnant, gets one of his own. Will this be a kill on Quake? But the hook shot is there. He pushes them back, so he has a little extra stun. Well played by Ice 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 and DJ. The dodge of the Aether Remnant into the steal. Well played. This guy and his steals under pressure, Ooh. man. It's all in your head. He's a good one. Who's your guys' favorite four player right now? Obviously, besides like High Gun Liquid, does anyone just stand out? We are going to see initiation. They want to bring down the Semper Can they? Eight the remnants there again. They bring down Taiga, but they might get one. No, the Ember makes it out. Boxy's going to die instead, and. It's looking like a crumble cake here because it's all falling apart for them. Insania is going to go down as well. It's a three for zero trade. That's a feels bad trade. Yeah. Like that's, that's a trade. <laughs> it's, 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 it's a, a giveaway. Tra it's yeah. a giveaway. <laughs> <laughs> there was nothing being given back to Liquid. And that's a 6K lead now. Fnatic, the, the first team to qualify out of SEA. So we know they are strong. They have had some some so so showings here. Trolls get ulti. Wants to get that net. He gets the net. Koikva goes just down. Respond. Yeah, that is. Oh man, they're just getting run over now. Everywhere on the yeah, map, right. Fnatic is, and that's as you said, Blitz. It's the laning phase. You lose like all three lanes like that. You're just gonna get steamrolled. Zamboni on. So one of the weird things about that matchup, Clockwork versus uh, Dark Willow, can't get hit by battery assault while you're Shadow Realm, but you also can't get out of the cogs by yourself without getting out of Shadow without Realm. Without getting out yeah. of Shadow Realm, so. 
So like I say, 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 she just sits there and doesn't kill his own cogs. There's nothing Taika could usually do. It was a tricky situation indeed, Austin. Mm. Can he? Oh, doesn't use the transfer to block him down the hill. He's just running away. Can he make it? The sprout? The Does corner. he fake? He tries to fake. Nice oh. fake out. Pretended he sprouted himself and goes around yeah. the corner. Nice play. <laughs> the insta voice lines by everybody. Yeah. I like voice lines. A lot more than tips. It's funnier. Why yeah. does why are all uh, I saw last game? Why are all of Wraith Kings in caps? Because he's, he's a king. He's yelling at all he times. He's decreeing oh, he stuff. Okay. Oh. So what if I swagger? You know, he's just always yeah. yelling. Okay. Yeah, he's a bad king. Yeah. Dude, if you're the king, Grant, you can do whatever you want. True. I don't think I would always want to yell though. I feel like I'd want to whisper so that like all the peasants would have to like come in to hear me. Yeah, but they can. They can't get close enough to you. Exactly. <laughs> Stay the hell <laughs> so away from me, don't hear it. Yeah, don't So they just don't hear anything you as, say as ever? Someone, as someone in a royal heritage, I don't want any peasants around me ever. <laughs> Grant, could you see yourself becoming like a, a, a benevolent king? leader? Or like, <laughs> would you be like, you're instantly just like installing like a... Uh, Tyranny? <laughs> yeah. Would you do the, like, the, the thing that nobody likes, but it's better for them anyway? Would you be that kind of person? <sighs> like That's you have the tough. vision to see what's good for them. Yeah. They may not like it. But. Yeah. I think I'd be in between, you know. Ooh, Hookshot does whip. They get the pushback. Ice Ice Ice, he's stuck here. Is Boxy stuck here? I'm not really sure. Well, Boxy's stuck there, it looks like. <laughs> they will get the trade here on Ice Ice Ice, but Taiga goes down as well. Mickey has to wave form out, and it's a 10k lead now at 15 minutes in. Cap, I'd be in between. I'd make some bad calls, but I'd make some good calls, you know, to mm. let them know I am for the people, Pewdiepie. but, like, the yes, people are below me. Lives on. Every once in a while, you just put them in check. Yeah, uh, you just you know, give them the metaphorical backhand. But then, like on a Monday, a random Monday, is the king a decree? Everyone gets it off. Mm. And who doesn't love a Monday off after a weekend? Exactly. 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 I like Mondays. Well, do you work on <laughs> eight to five? <laughs> do you work on eight to five? Depression sets in <laughs> Sunday night at nine p.m. Realizing your soul drains up. I've been there. The, Trust the me, anxiety, everyone. I've been there. The anxiety of Sunday, yeah. where like your whole day's kind of ruined because yeah. you're like, I have to go back to work tomorrow. Dude, it really is. Like Friday nights and Saturdays are great. Yeah. Sunday morning, you wake up like I got the day off, and then as it creeps forward, you're like, oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Nether shell scooped up by the radiant. Now that we've been seeing these neutral items for so long, we can actually discuss which ones are any straight up overpowered now. Now that we've seen them and we Enchanted know, and I'm not quiver. Um, I, I'm and well, let's just go with like the tier one through three brooch, items. I think is okay. That's the really mana move good. speed, right? It, yeah, it gives uh, uh, 225 mana yeah. and then 25 movement speed, so that's a free win lace. Oh, moon. Is in a little bit of trouble. Does he dodge a stun? No, it still hits him afterwards. Mickey's pounding down oh, on him, but look at that ice. He was too low. He was. He just gets blasted by the clockwork. And I mean, you're, I understand the play, right? Mickey has to get that kill there. Yeah. He There's was so trying he to morph down, to be. Yeah. but he was already low on HP. So he was thinking, like, I'll just morph down, cast Burst my... him. Yeah. And really instead, easy. he just dies. Ice, ice, ice. Having a, a very clean game right now. Let's see. Any straight up broken ones? Um, I agree. Faded bro. Seems, uh, and uh, on a carry, right? You have these, like, strength cores now. You just get yeah. 225. That's two more stuns on, like, a Wraith King or something. I think Essence Ring got a uh, bit overbuffed. Yeah. Ooh, stuns a flying 23. Savage says, hello, I'll stun you as well, DJ. I like uh, Royal Jelly because I'm a Storm player. Royal Jelly and tru Trusty that. Shovel inherently are like a little broken. I think broken Trusty Shovel is very good. Because they're like, uh, they're, they're the only tier one items that are useful throughout the entire game. Yeah. yeah. So there's, there's something a little broken with that. I would say uh, my favorite item to always get, it's good, and I love it, is Spider Legs, right? Yeah. Who, do who doesn't like all of a sudden changing the nature of their game to be able to, like, just have fun? Not not carry your boots anymore if yep. you want to, or go and just run up cliffs. Spider it up. So many heroes that, like, all of a sudden get countered by a random Spider Legs. Like who, Austin? Well, my boy Clockwork, for one. Oh, they're going to blink for it. They want to get this kill. Can they find DJ? He actually had the ulti, but won't matter. DJ gets bursted down. They will get that shrine. Dang, that's a that's an unstoppable streak. Uh-oh, and there's getting an ulti. He just wants to permanently net him. Will he? No, nice. Frank into the stun. And now he's under the tower, but 23 Savage doesn't care. There's the 12k up. I don't think it matters. Mika gets bursted down, and we just saw him. He has a Diffusal Manta Aegis at, I believe he added 18 minutes. 
uh, you said it, troll free farm top, and then he was allowed to free farm bottom, and I mean, there's not much you can do when, when the laning phase does go that poorly. 23 Savage continues to just beat down the tower, beat down the supports. There's gonna be a melee rag. 23 Savage, he says, nah, I'd rather go for the kill on Boxy. There's gonna have to be a buyback. Moon's in a lot of trouble, but he does make it out. He doesn't have the Aegis. He's gonna get earned up, gets the kill. This Diffusion Blade's been oh, so effective. Goodness. It really is. He has destroyed him. And they get the melee racks before the 20 minute mark, so they'll be coming out in about 10 seconds. Will he get the range racks before it? You actually need to get the racks three seconds before the creep spawn or else you don't get the supers and magas. I don't know why. Really? It's the same as Roche, right? When it says, will respawn in one, it's actually uh -huh. two seconds after. There's like an innate two second delay on all like the the weird things. I had no like idea. That. Yeah. So that's for, for, super, for, for super creeps as for well as magas? and magas. Yeah, so oh. if you kill it at like 1959, you will not get the supers at the 20 minute mark. You'll get them at 2030. It's not a big deal. It's just one of those, f it's the same with Roche, right? It respawns two yeah. seconds after it says it will. Dang. Just a weird thing. Grand chopping those knowledge bombs. It man. literally doesn't mean Learned much, but yeah. <laughs> Nether Shaw, uh, they just found their last and then tier two item there. No, three out of four, actually. Not much jungling from Fnatic. I mean, they've just been bullying lanes the entire time. No need to go to the jungle. Rubik gets his blink. If you're killing as much as they are, you don't you die. Yeah. Yet your Gives the essence ring. We'll see who takes it on Fnatic, but they're just so confident on the map. In, even in the first game, they're always on the other side of the map. Ooh, steals the strength morph. He is morphing. Will push him back. Can they drain the mana or lock him down? There's going to be a silence from Jeb as well. Can he kill it off? Will Ghost Scepter himself, but you get Fade Bolt in your Ghost Scepter with the Arcane Supremacy. That's a lot of damage. Yeah, the Phantom's Embrace is really effective against Morphling, who's on the, the back foot, right? You're morphing into strength. It slows your attack speed. Your Ghost you, Scepter and you're you Ghost Scepter attack. yourself. You can't attack it. Ooh, and they're, they're just in the base. They give zero cares right now. There goes Boxy. And an even more dominating performance from game one. Ice Ice Ice, he's, he's just bullying them. They get the next groups as well. And there's ZA just taken away. Will full heal his man in HP. I think he was full anyways. And Zanya, will he be able to? No, nah, he's definitely not no. getting this tower, and he's definitely not surviving. He wanted to make a little bit of pressure on the map. He does. Double DJ uh, jabs. Double blinks now. There's so much catch yeah. between these two supports. Blitz be straight up real. Is this game unwinnable? Yes. Yeah. Ooh, does miss the hook shot. Was Blitz wrong? The Ember Spirit's there. He goes down. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> there is the 1%. Blitz is on the train, but it's going to be the buyback. Moon can't make it. He does have his spirit down. They get a double lockdown on the backside on two cores. Taiga goes down. Koikva still trying to evade them all. Can they get Mickey? Okay. They link two of them together. That is going to be a double silence. Moves forward. There is the buyback on Moon. You got to be careful. Maybe he doesn't. He is just going to kill them all. And we see the voice lines. We might be seeing some Gs drop here. They're just going to bully down. I believe there's still one more Rax top as well. So let's see if they go for the Megas off the back of this. I love the sound of a troll hitting a building, just slowly building up in like Caden figure. Yeah. And there's the GG's called, so man. Fnatic, as we said, the first team to qualify to the major out of SEA, and we see why. They look they look good. They look damn good right now. Liquid, on the other hand, obviously they aren't going to the minor major, maybe experimenting a little. You you kind of do the same draft two games in a row and it doesn't work out. Yeah, I don't know. You guys got any, any thoughts to that? Just the laning phase, it felt like both games. Yeah, I mean, I've got some thoughts about it, Grant, but yes. uh, I believe first. What? Don't we have to go to a commercial? Do we? I don't know. Well, anyway, Blitz, are we, uh, <laughs> does Liquid suck or do we suck? Because we liked both of Liquid's draft and uh, they didn't turn out. I think we're going through some hard times right now. Mm. We'll, uh, we'll, we'll figure out a way. Was that laning phase supposed to be that bad? Uh, I don't think bottom should have gone as bad as it did. Mm. I think that was probably the lane that I was surprised that Ice 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 got as much as he did in it. Yep. And you see Fnatic getting all their phones back after the win. They're like, time to go look on how everybody loves me. Probably actually going to the stream right now because we are going to go to a quick break. When we get back, a winner's interview with Fnatic. And hello, we are back. Series number one has get ended. It. Fnatic versus Liquid Fnatic. Kind of having their way with Liquid right now. We do have Insania. 
Hello. I think this it, is the well, winner's there, interview. There, there, uh, oh, sorry. I apologize. No, 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 we, we, do not, we do not have a winner. Oh, uh, the winner's Fnatic, interview? Fnatic has to play next against Cloud9, oh, so they are just going to get ready for that. I'll do the winner's interview for them. All right. Okay. Uh, so, Insania, great drafts. Uh, you, you countered the Slardar Dark Willow. Yeah. How'd that go? I mean, Liquid, they're kind of, like, stubborn. Yeah. They have this idea. They just pick five stunts, and then they just try to run at you. And I feel like they've been doing this for years. So it's just kind of easy, you know? Their, their captain really needs to step up his game and come up with something new. True. <laughs> well, I yeah. I mean, they're, they're way too predictable, honestly, this Liquid squad. What do you they... think uh, you guys did as Fnatic? What do you think you did right in that game? Everything. And Everything? I mean, the thing is... The I mean, they make is, it easy, right? Yeah, Liquid exactly. make like, it easy it's like for you're you to playing look good. Like, I don't want to be too rude here, but like they're not even pubs. Like my pubs are harder than this. Like Liquid really need to. You guys need to step it up, guys. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you for that one. Uh, when do you guys play next? Are you? Uh, we're playing up against Cloud Nine. Okay. Yeah. In the third series, I assume. Us as in Liquid Second. or Fnatic? Liquid. Sorry. Both of us. <laughs> sorry, now, yeah, my, uh, both of you. <laughs> I think we're both playing Cloud Nine next. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Cool. Awesome. <laughs> An interview with oh, a shattered you, mind. No, Will's just nonstop flaming us. <laughs> I'm a goon. Yo, can I tell your subway story, Boxy? Yes, please do. Please do. Did you say Will, no? Please, please. Please the tell the subway story. The yesterday's. Guys, the story is lit. Okay, please. okay, wait. Get on the mic. You can get, get on, on the mic. mic get right on here. Th Boxy. Fuck with. Boxy. <laughs> <laughs> get on this mic. So, what major was it? Last one. <laughs> no, dream. Sure it was no, <laughs> it was Dream. I told Dream League. The Dream League major, I got a subway sandwich from our dear manager, Chloe. And I put it in my backpack after I ate half of it. And then uh, I forgot that it was there. <laughs> and then I f like four weeks later at Summit, I was like, my backpack smells really bad. <laughs> and I find like a rotten Subway sandwich. <laughs> There's mayonnaise everywhere. Yeah. Oh, uh, no mayo, but I don't know. It, it was dark. <laughs> it was <laughs> very dark. <laughs> and sticky, I don't know. <laughs> what did you it was like it? it was like duct tape. <laughs> How did like you clean it out? You didn't like touch it, did uh, you? Or I asked. <laughs> I mean, I pulled it out. I asked Chloe to ask Liquid for a new backpack. So we'll see how that goes. <laughs> Are you still using that? Sorry, backpack? Victor. Old <laughs> trusty. Great, great. Give it a whiff. Give it a whiff, Willis. <laughs> oh yeah, that's. I love mayonnaise. Rotten mayonnaise, even more so. Hey, at least he's vegetarian. So if if, if he wasn't, that could have been much worse that there was some meat in there yeah and you see it liquid fanatic fanatic just as we said had their way with liquid 23 to 7 and that means coming up next it will be fanatic versus c9 and c9 they were over in you know sda but now they've moved back they are an na team you got you got a european player you got ace but got other players it, just first thoughts before we go to a quick break and break it down who do you think's favorite is this fanatic after this yeah. it has to be right yeah. big for I've sure. never seen Cloud9 play, so it's going to be a... Uh... Oh, it's going to be interesting. One player to watch out for on C9 right now. Um, <laughs> Eternal Envy. I'm going to say the king. The king. The king. Snake himself. We are going to head to a short break. When we get back, we're going to break this down. Well, I don't know if I'm still on it, but someone's going to break it down. We've got the new Cloud9. This is freaking C9, one of the biggest orgs in NA. Can they show... That they keep that title, a world fanatic. Hit him with a couple of these, a couple Let's of go, those. Grant. We'll have to see. See you soon.